In this FTMO robot guide you will learn exactly how to use the FTMO robot app and what to do with the robots from downloading them to passing your first challenge. It will be a complete guide for the FTMO robot so stay tuned. The FTMO robot app allows you to see the performance of all the expert advisors in the current version plus you can set your challenge. For example the latest challenge I bought was 200k the max loss was 6% and the max daily loss was 4% but I would strongly suggest you to test the FTMO robots first on an FTMO trial account so if I open the FTMO website and I scroll down to the challenges you will see that for the 10k challenge the maximum daily loss is $500 and the maximum loss is $1000 so I can set that in the FTMO app I will simply switch to 10k and as well I will set the max loss to $1,000 and max daily loss to $500. Profit target is 10% as well and the app automatically recalculated the statistics according to a 10k challenge plus I can decide the risk I want to take. If I select the medium or 1% per trade it means that whenever the trades hit the stop loss it will lose no more than one percent from my account if I want higher risk of two percent then each losing trade or each trade that hits the stop loss would result in a two percent loss in the account the low risk would result in a 0.5 percent maximum loss per trade however I'll stick to medium risk for the purpose of the video and I'll select to use the news filter on only during the high impact use. Now I can download each expert advisor for MetaTrader 4 or MetaTrader 5 or I can add them all to zip and I can download them for MetaTrader 4 and for MetaTrader 5. Now let me show you how to open a free trial account with FTMO and how to install MetaTrader if you are a complete beginner and then I will show you how to install the experts on the charts. So I'll go back to the FTMO website and I will start a free trial. For the purpose of the video I will stick to $10,000 account balance. I will select FTMO swing account where the leverage is 1 to 30 and I can hold trades overnight and over the weekend. I also can hold the trades during the news and that is why I prefer the swing account and the news filter applied in the FTMO robots will only disable the robots while there is high impact news or basically it will avoid entering into new trades but the current open trades will remain running through the news and that's the option I prefer to use. You can select MetaTrader 4 or MetaTrader 5 and for the purpose of the video I will select MetaTrader 5 and I will start the trial. And here is my account number, the master password and the server. I will download MetaTrader 5 and now I will show you how to install it on my computer. The better solution is to use a VPS or this is a virtual private server which is a virtual machine and and there are plenty of websites that offer these services but the good thing is that you won't disconnect from the internet. So here is one of my VPS's and I have pasted the installation file. I will double click on it and I will install it on my computer. I can select the installation folder and once I hit on next it will start installing on my VPS. While it is installing, I want to point out that if you decide to install the MetaTrader platform on your computer at home or your laptop, you need to keep it running 24-7 or at least from Monday to Friday because if you shut down your computer or your laptop falls asleep, this will disconnect MetaTrader from the internet and the robots will stop working. So if you are unable to run your machine 24-7, it is 
best to use a VPS. Once the platform is installed, I will copy paste my account number and as well, I will copy paste the password. I will click on OK and it will log in to the free trial. Now what I will do, I will copy the experts I downloaded from the FTMO robot app and I will paste them on the VPS and install them on the MetaTrader platform. So on this VPS, I have just the MetaTrader platform and a folder where I'll paste the robots. Here they are on my computer. So I will select the robots for MetaTrader 5. I will copy them and I will paste them to my VPS. Then if I click on the first one, it will open the source code of the expert advisor. And that is pretty cool because with the FTMO robots, you receive the source code. There is nothing hidden. If you are a developer, you can modify anything in the code. If you are not, I don't suggest you touch the code. So the only thing you need to do is to compile it. This will show you the ready to use robot in the folder. And I will do the very same thing for the other seven expert advisors. And once I have them all, I will put the experts on the charts. What I need to do, I need to copy the ready files and I need to put them on MetaTrader. How I do that, if I open the platform, I will go to file, open data folder. I will click on MQL5 experts and this is where I will paste the expert advisors. I will close the folder and I will right click over expert advisors and I will hit on refresh. The expert advisors will display below and you can see in the name, the version of the robot, the size of the account, the risk I selected to use, the asset I'm going to trade and the time frame. So pay attention that the different FTMO robots on the different assets are trading on different time frames. This is for the purpose of achieving better risk diversification. And at the end, we have unique magic numbers that you can change if you decide to. Then what I will do, I will enable the algo trading on the top. I will go to tools, I will hit on options and I will click on expert advisors. I will allow web requests and I will add the website forexsb.com and I will hit on OK. And you have to do that to be able to use the news filter in the FTMO robots. Now the next thing to do is to place the Aussie Swiss because this is the asset for the first expert advisor. I will switch to M30 and I will remove the one click trading because I don't need it. With control G, I can remove the grid behind. You can customize the chart as you wish, but you don't need to put anything more than the expert advisor. So I'll just drag and drop it over the chart and I will see the inputs, which I will go over in a minute. But first, let me put all of the expert advisors on the chart. So I'll click on OK and you will see a lot of information on the chart, which I will explain as well. But first I will put all of the EAs on the chart. The second one is Aussie dollar on M5. If you do not see the asset, you can click on show all. In this case, I see Aussie dollar. So I'll right click and I will click on chart window. I will switch to M5. I will remove the grid and I will drag and drop the expert advisor. I'll just click on OK and the second expert advisor is attached on the chart and I will do the very same thing for the rest of the expert advisors. And it takes no more than two to three minutes, probably five if you are doing it for the very first time. So now let me show you the inputs of the expert advisors. I'll go to any of the expert advisor properties, let's say for the gold. You will see that the entry lot is 0 0.01 and it was calculated automatically by the FTA more robot app before I downloaded the expert advisors according to the account size and the risk I selected in the app. In this case, one more time, I select
back to $10,000 with the medium risk. So the app calculated that it should not trade more than 0.01 for the gold according to the 5,000 pips stop loss. So if the trade hits the stop loss, it will not lose more than 1% or this is the medium risk. And then we have the take profit, the entry hour by default we trade between 1 a.m and 11 p.m and this is because we want to avoid opening trades at midnight when the spreads are drastically higher but you can change that in the inputs as well we use the envelopes the d marker mark the rsi and you can see the parameters for the current version then below we have some entry protections for example you can set the spread to 30 points or that would be three pips for the currency pairs at the moment of recording the video i see that for the gold the spread is about 20 25 or maximum 30 points so if you decide to put a value and there is an entry signal but at this moment the spread is higher the expert advisor will not execute the trade i'll leave it on zero and i'll show you some more of the input Puts, we have max open positions, max open lots. But the interesting part is here, account protections. The maximum daily loss was automatically set to $490 for a 10K challenge. And the minimum equity is set to $9,010, which means that if the account reaches any of these values, it will close all the trades and disable the expert advisors from the charts. As as well we have the maximum equity which guarantees that if your account reaches the target it will close all trades automatically this is what happened with one of the latest challenges i passed you can see that the maximum equity protection is activated and this happened once i reached the target which was five thousand dollars in 50k challenge and this is very useful because it might happen that your equity will reach the target but if you're not in front of the computer to close the trades it might drop and this will not count so you need to make sure that you close the trades once you reach the target and this is why we have set that protection below are the news filters so i have selected in the app to use only the high news filter but you can change that from from here as well and if I scroll lower you will notice that you have the choice to decide how long we want to wait before the news and after the news then on the bottom we have the statistics so you can decide if you want to display the indicators and this is only for MetaTrader 5 and below are the statistics for the position and the robot so if I click on OK you will see that it displays the indicators but this is not a must one more time only if you want to see where exactly the robots will execute the entries but i will remove the indicators now to show you the stats displayed on the top you will see the current version of the robot your name as the licensed user and the magic number then we have the protections that we have activated maximum daily loss minimum equity and maximum equity so we can see what is the current one at any moment there are position stats but for this account i don't have any because i just installed the expert advisors and then we have some robot stats which is very very useful i will tell you why in a second and below are the upcoming news so you don't need to look at forex calendars you will know at any moment once there is upcoming news and some of the trades might not be triggered if you have selected to use the news filter and if you want to backtest the expert advisors on metatrader you can do that for example i will click on pound aussie 
and I will right click over it in the navigator and I will click on test. The strategy tester will open below and you need to select the expert advisor, the symbol, the time frame. You can select a custom period or you can select the last month, last one year, entire history or I will stick to a custom period for the last five years. This is usually what I'm looking at when backtesting expert advisors. And then as modeling, you have a few options, but I'll suggest you to use open prices only because these expert advisors open trades at the opening of the next bar. So if you have the confirmation on one of the candlesticks that the trade should be open at the opening of next one, the order will execute. That is why we use open prices only. And pretty much that's it. I will click on start and the back test is extremely fast. If I show you the graph, you will see what it looks like. It started on $10,000 and it reached nearly $19,000. And we don't really aim to have the perfect back test for the strategies, just like most of the Martingale systems that are being sold on the marketplace. But we prefer to have a logical trading strategy behind the robots. And if I show you the back test, you will see some more of the results. You can see what the profit factor is, the gross profit, the gross loss. But you really don't need to do that because if I show you the FTMO up one more time, you will see that it is absolutely the same back test that we have on the app. So just click on the graph and I will show you the pound Aussie. Right in here, you can see that it started with $10,000 and over the last five years, it reached nearly 19,000. It is the very same back test just on the app it is a small window and on MetaTrader it is a big one but you can see that it is absolutely the same result or the same back test and we achieved this same results because the FTMO app uses the historical data from FTMO server so you really don't need to do a back test on the MetaTrader it is already done on the FTMO app and whenever you open the app you will see what is the back test for the current version of the FTMO robots and now let me tell you how we select which one of the eight robots to put on a challenge so far we were tracking the results on my FX book or FX blue so for example with this 25k challenge I used the top one performer or in other words I was testing the eight expert advisors on a free trial account and I connected this account to my FX book and on this challenge I was placing only the top performers and in this case they were the euro dollar and the pound Canadian and I achieved 10% pretty quickly because I used the scaling system. So to make it easier for the beginners, we put the eight EAs on a trial account. We track the performance using my FX book or FX blue and we put on the challenge only the top performer for the last one week. So if it is the pound Canadian most profitable, then we would trade pound Canadian only. And then if it is the euro dollar show best results then we would put the euro dollar in this account on another 25k challenge I was keeping for example the top three performers so in this case I was still testing the eight robots on a trial tracking the performance and selecting the best three for the last one week and I was placing those in this challenge and it achieved 8% target which was the target so for example this is the trial account where I was tracking a previous version of the robots and usually I would look at the last one week. Then I would go lower and I'll click on summary and I can see at any moment which is the us 
asset that brings the best profits. And in this case, it is the Euro Aussie that was the most profitable for the selected period. So I was trading just Euro Aussie on another challenge. Or if you want to use the top three, simply you can see them in here. And in this case, it was the Aussie Swiss and Pound Aussie. However, with the latest version of the FTMO robots, you don't need to do that because the results are on the charts. One more time, if I show you any of the robots, you will see robot stats on the graph. And once I have trades, I'll be able to see what was the profit today, this week or this month. And I don't need to connect the account to my FX book to track the results. I can simply switch between the different charts and I will see the statistics. Plus, we are planning to update the FTMO robot app with the same statistic on the app itself so you will be able to see which is the top performer for the last one week or the last one month and this will make it very easy for everyone because all you need to do is to grab a challenge, see which are the top performers in the FTMO app and select which ones you want to put on your challenge. But recently I also passed a challenge where I was trading all of the robots in one account and that was a 50k challenge where I traded all of the expert advisors simultaneously. I reached the target of $5,000 and if I show you the you will see that all of them were trading the most profit came from Euro Aussie, Gold, Pound Aussie and Aussie Dollar. So I was using medium risk and once the account reached 5%, I increased it to high risk. So I doubled the lots and this way I reached the target faster. One more time, if you look at the app, you will see that with medium risk, we risk 1% per trade and with a high risk, we risk 2% per trade. And that is also something we are planning to automate in the robots. So stay tuned to all of the videos in the channel. If you have any questions, just let me know down below in the comments, but I'll leave it up to you to decide if you want to trade all of the robots or you want to put them on a trial account, track the performance and see which assets or which robots are the most profitable for you. It is absolutely your choice and responsibility how you will be trading the expert advisors in our video videos we share our experience so we try to make sure it's useful for everyone watching the videos as always i thank you very much for staying with me until the end of the video check out this video before you go so you will know more about how i passed the very recent challenge thank you for watching and being my subscriber and i will see you in the next video